once again into the light of the moon, said Christopher, as he walked on the moon. Oh, is that you? Oh my, have you interrupted me again? Oh, well, don't I feel embarrassed? Gosh, you interrupted me on my team tie again. Oh, the second time I'm marking this down. This is going to need to, you know, you're going to have to pay me back. Interrupting me in this beautiful book of knowledge and acknowledgement. That's right. So, I see you've come back to watch some more. Of me, that is. Christopher Banks. Well, I've brought you a special guest here, all the way from... Where are you from, my special guest of loveliness? I'm from Canada. You're from Canada? Oh, my! What part of Canada are you from? Ontario. On, uh, on, on, Ontario? Oh, no big deal. It's just, you know, the main province of Canada. What's this? Well, so what are you doing in Canada right now, Paisy? Are you snowshoeing? Are you skiing? You know, canoeing? Polar bear riding? What are you doing in Canada, Paisley? Is it snowing? Give us some info, buddy. It's not snowing right now. Oh, well, uh, isn't that unfortunate? Because in Britain it's snowing like you wouldn't even know. It's coming down in... Bangers and mash, you know? It's just coming down! Anyways, moving on with the subject of today's topic, which is my middle name. You know it's Christopher and Banks, but you don't know my middle name. Would you like to know it? I think you do. I think you want to know my middle name. And if you didn't already know, it's Waffles. Yes, we're not going to make any sick jokes about the blue waffle because I have know it even though I'm across the pond. My middle name is Waffle. Christopher Waffle Banks. I love waffles. I eat them in the morning and in the night. I use them as frisbees. I use waffles for everything. I use them for a hat. I use them for a kind of hiding device. Look at this. I use them to juggle with. You want to see me juggle some pancakes? Look at this. That's my juggling skills right there, buddies. I use it for a frisbee. Watch this. You want to see this frisbee go flying? Watch. That was my waffle flying. That's what. That's right. You want to see another cool waffle? You want know to do it in the morning with my waffle? Look at that. Look at this. It's a friggin' It's a smiley waffle. Look at it. Look at it. I named it Wilson for you. Look. Its name is Wilson. Wilson the waffle. Oh, look at Wilson. I like Wilson. I eat him every morning. I give him a little smiley face. He says, good morning, Christopher. I say, good morning, Wilson. Now you know the waffle situational going on over in Britain with my waffle. Okay. Moving on is your two words of the day, which I'm going to teach you how to say in the wonderful British accent for you. Oh, my God. Okay, first word of the day is idiot. Idiot. You are a idiot. You are such an idiot. You've gotten that. Pronounce it with me now. Idiot. Idiot. Next word of the day, number two, coming to you is computer. Now, Canadians, you have those accents of yours and how do you precisely say computer computer you say computer or something like that something stupid you gotta say it properly and properly is how i'm gonna show you computer computer that's how you do it here computer okay so your two words going over them one more time idiot computer let's put them in a sentence for you i was talking to an idiot on the computer it's magical. You should trot out some Tom. Okay, so other than that, I've gone over my main topic and my two words. Is that the checklist, Canadian? Yeah. Is my checklist good? That's good. That's awesome. I'll be coming to you on a later date to tell you a little bit more about the British language and maybe our next big topic. Who knows what it will be? Maybe I'll be interviewing some big movie star. But coming from you to me, I'm Christopher Waffle Banks signing off with you on this wonderful day in Britain as I talk to you. Have a good day. Tune in next time. Subscribe. You know what to do. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye.